Good evening everyone and welcome back to another Farming Simulator 22 uh, live stream. This is number 8 I think. Yeah, 8 already. Wow. Uh, we're on Hot Better on again. Uh, I'm just looking at the crop calendar. At the moment we're at the very start of March. So there's not a lot we can do at them. Well, we've just uh, done the planting, haven't we? So probably do some fertilising. Um, apart from that, uh, contracts and selling whatever we've got. Uh, that's what we'll be doing today. Anyway, let's see what we've got in stream. We've got Riot, we've got Train Fan, and we've got Mr. Quicko and Christopher. Hopefully, everyone is all well. I'm not too sure how busy it is going to be. Uh, Farm some usually is quiet as it is, so obviously, being almost 10 at night, I don't know how it is going to be. But we'll get on with it and see what we get up to. So let's just do it. When are you going to stream Flight Sim? Uh, not too sure, Christopher, at some point. Uh, so, first off, I'm going to finish what I was doing last time. Why is this tractor over here? Let's quickly get that out of the way. Let's get to where it should be, over it. Let's quickly move that. Now I bet we're paying to drive these ones. Hello Max, how are you? Hello Laterjet, how are you as well? Let's quickly readjust that. There we go, cool. There's Daniel, how are you as well? Uh, what is going on there? Let's uh, get this out of the way. Um, that is most peculiar. Um, right, let's move out there. Uh, let's uh, continue with this. So we're going up to the farm shop we were in the last one. The Christmas tea, Christmas tree decoration duty calls. So I had to do that. Uh, anyway, we're going up uh, this one. I'm good, right? How are you? Got the uh, strawberries on the back. Then we'll go back and get some more. Uh, finish this and then do some fertilising. Then we've got to wait until April until we can start sowing the corn. Which will be, uh, be alright. Yeah, it's going to sell this. You're still all hate nice, Daniel. Hello Munchies, how are you? We'll come up saying tomatoes, the strawberries can't be sold here. There we go, you have to come round to... What the hell? That was weird, that like, caught us. Got to come round to here. And we can then sell our goods. There we go, off they go. Quite cool though, isn't it, seeing that. Like, all of the pallets. So you get a bit of money for that, not a lot, but a little bit. Not a lot though. A little bit more that time actually though. 2.4k, every little helps. Right, let's take this back to the farm, get it loaded up and go again. I'm thinking about doing fertilising as well. Fair enough, right? Let's go. Right, right side of the road, yeah. Now we're in France, get back to the other side. <laughs> Cool. Oh god, so it's, it's fairly, especially in the car, it's hard to drive on here with a controller. Especially at this sort of speed. Right, let's, uh, let's get back. Evening, Amanda. And uh, let's get those uh, pallets on. Let's try and get all of them sold. Whiz through the town. And we're going right over here. Why is the bell going off now? It's 12.24. Right around we go. Yeah, hopefully everyone's all well this evening. Turn and left it. That will take us back to the farm. <laughs> uh, that was uh, 
just to see when I got everything done, Glenbug got everything done early, Curry came early, so yeah, I thought let's let's start now. I can chill out after for a bit. Very. <laughs> hey then, Pete. Well, I'm early for once. It's early. Limit that. How many chickens do we have? So we didn't have that many last time, did we? Don't know. Well, they've all escaped. Oh, yeah, so we didn't have that many last time. Right, let's uh, load this up again. Try to catch us out. Right, there we go. Uh, let's get these sides down. Uh, yeah, that would do. Played too much of Bustin' 20 on, got stuck on a few things on the campaign. So I watched one of your videos to help. Awesome, let's check. Did that help out? Hopefully it did. It almost worked. Yeah, I'm not sure why the forklift was down there. Um, but let's get that back. Yeah, doing a bit of this to start off with. Stacking pallets. That has to be done though, if we want to get these sold. And knock that a little bit. Yeah. We're so early, Glenn, I nearly missed the stream. You did a timetable, Mr. Streamer. Yeah, it has been a bit on and off today. Um, well, a bit off today. But yeah, the bed table thingy building took a bit longer than like anticipated. So we would have done farms in probably about 6 p.m. Probably even, maybe even before that. What another one? I just been mean, got this one on. Awesome, ladies and gentlemen, what was that? I'm going to send it was Mission 7, or Episode 7. That's quite popular on that one. I think it's the balance route to Gold Island. Super seem to struggle on. Which is fair enough. Right, let's uh, whack that on. There you go. Uh, what have we been taking? Right, those ones. I think they're tomatoes. Let's continue with them bit of a tomato load. Let's uh, bring that down. And then tomorrow's streams will be Cooking Sim, Cooking Sim, TSW, and I don't know. I have to wait and see. Right, oh wait, just, just yeah, go bugger off there. Right, that's all. Let's uh, spike that on. Uh, do you know what streams are tomorrow? Uh, yes, uh, Cooking Sim. Even in Power How, you're Cooking Sim, TSW, and. I don't know. Uh, whatever. Tickles the mind, I guess. Can I help out the fuck you sure can, Power? I'll get you working on a contract, probably. Uh, probably so there's not really much else to do. There is fertilising, actually, if you want to do some fertilising. So we. Um, seeded the fields but I don't think we actually fertilised last time so well no we didn't because the sower had the fertiliser in it so I don't think we do need to fertilise Pete what would you say do you think we need to fertilise I mean it's blue but it's not dark blue does it need to be dark blue it says it's fertilised though I think alright get some more tomatoes the weather it is set to rain yeah, it'll be raining soon. That'll uh, be in the next half of the day. Hello, refocus. Welcome back, mate. See, one thing I do want to get started with is cows. That's always fun doing the silage and the grass bells and all that sort of stuff. So as soon as we have enough for that, we will have a look at that. Makes it a bit more different, doesn't it? Well, I think you need to build the cow farm, which uh, is going to be quite a bit. So, not for a little while. I say by episode hmm, 20, where we might have cows. Yeah, pass was BA uh, para. Should be in capitals, if not try lowercase. Right, let's get that other one there. Look, if you had like six greenhouses, you know, the amount you're gonna 
pallets you're going to get. The thing is, I don't know, does this need to be filled up? We got, oh, 19,000 litres of water. Probably not. <laughs> God, please. Well said, though. Please pick a number and hope you get lucky. Well, we'll start the first one at two, possibly. Yeah, we'll be in the kitchen tomorrow, which always ends horribly wrong. So, that will be tomorrow. Let's whack that in. There we go. Can we see another TS route tomorrow? Uh, maybe there's a chip. Uh, what TSW route should I do? I struggle all the time. Munich to Augsburg, if you've got it. I should know, because I think you've got Habstrucker Rhymer, didn't you? Um, do Habstrucker Rhymer and do a service from. I think it's an S3 service. Yeah, an S3 service. Even in power? Yeah, I'm all good. How are you? I'm good. Cool. Yeah, uh, if we get you on a contract, tell me when you're. Well, I think you're probably in now. Get a bit by then. 2:34 p.m. Possibly. Yeah, I'm good. Refocus. Good day. It is funny, yes. Right, let's get power on a contract. In fact, power, I'll let you pick contracts. I know you know what you're doing, okay. so. Manage contracts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. You probably want to borrow the equipment as well with contracts. Yeah, no problem. There you go, it's that on there. Sounds good, right? Yeah, I think it's the S3. I'll do a regional barn 48. Which I think it's a regional barn 48. Sorry, we got, uh, Joe. Pardon? How much time do we have got? So I'm not. Uh, <laughs> I'm uh, we've got well, probably until we'll say eleven. Yeah, we'll say eleven. Okay, so about an hour and uh, yeah, about an hour. <laughs> Clip sounds good, uh, laser jet. Right, I'm going to go and sell these again. I'll sell it at the same place, uh, as I doubt there'll be much of a difference elsewhere. What was it? It was tomatoes, I think. Tomatoes. Oh, you can only sell them there anyway. Yeah. Let's go. And you're using the controller again. More chilled out. What do you use, power controller or will for this game or keyboard? I use uh, a PS4 controller, keyboard, and mouse. Oh, fair enough. <laughs> Just to keep it interesting. Ah, it works for me, so. <laughs> fair enough. And also a game I do want to do at some point again is SnowRunner. I've sort of been thinking about it and it's, like, and it's tempting to just give it another go, even if it's just one stream. What, yeah, it's multiplayer as well, so even better. Can you guys hear power? As uh, the game chat's always really quiet for some reason, even though it's on 100% volume. So hopefully you can uh, hear them alright. 12:53. That would be early. Yeah, that would be early. Can go for it though. Sounds good, Pete. Then you have to build the farm like on a field you own. I don't think you own the cow farm, do you? Can hear power up, nice.
There we're going slow. Oh, we're racing. It's Gran Turismo, quite literally. Oh, and I win. Right, at the sail point. I'm trying to go around this time, around this way. <laughs> it's quiet. All right, got ya. Yeah, game chat is fairly quiet, even on Max, which is uh, is odd. Right, let's have a look whilst that's unloading. I believe it's on Max, so. Uh, volume. Yeah, voice chat. It's on a uh, 100%. Oh, awesome, Pete. That's 5k. Slow but steady. Anywhere past two, I'd say, is a viable answer. Maybe half one, if you're lucky. Oh, God. It really depends on the time I go to bed, really, which usually, on a weekend, is 2 or 3 a.m., so, I don't know. Awesome refocus. Oh, you've been on Elm. Oh, yes, I know you've been on Elm Creek Company with Mod Pete. Right, let's go off this way. Even in Metro, how you doing? Oh, I'll come and see he's awake now. There's power. <laughs> like your <horse. laughs> 2.33 p.m. Ooh, that is one less, eh? Oh, and also with the giveaway code, uh, they messaged saying it would be... They were sourcing the codes, and that was yesterday, so... Probably over the weekend, so Monday. Uh, most likely, and that will be for a PlayStation 4 version of Train Simulator 2 the Rush Hour Deluxe Edition. That's the one I requested, so uh, yeah, I'll be giving that away hopefully sometime next week. And that will be to members as well. Hey, you doing, Crypto? Hopefully, you're all well. So probably what I'll do is I'll do a stream, um, and we'll say, you know, give away, um, and then I'll put the code into the members only area. No, members only post on YouTube, actually. Uh, I'll do that. Although I might do, actually, I might do the members only room on the Discord, because uh, that'll be a bit easier to find. Also, so YouTube might be a bit sort of, you know, why are you putting a code in the post area? Now, <laughs> 233. Fair enough. Yeah, it took way too long to get that thing done. We started at about quarter to. Uh, was it quarter to. Yeah, quarter. No, half one. Finished at about four. No, half four. It was only a small little thing as well. They had like, tons of little things you had to do with it. No brakes, I was just straight doing it. Awesome power. What about mem oh, uh, members only giveaway? Uh, yes, a PlayStation version of um, Train to Mod 2 Rush Hour Deluxe. From that around the globe challenge we did as ambassadors. Unfortunately, it was, it was only one code, so uh, if it was two, I'd have got the Xbox one as well. But I thought I'd go with PlayStation as that's sort of the console I'm I'm on. So, although even if you're not on PlayStation, you can still redeem the code uh, for if you ever do get a PlayStation in future. 
or looking to get a PlayStation. You're doing an early morning grain run, awesome. Right, let's uh, whack that on there. There we go. Oh, let's line it up a little bit better. Uh, there you go. No, it's, it's not going off. Go off. No. Wait, go off. There we go. No. I hope it's not going to do it. Yes. Might have to go around the other side quick and uh, push that a little. It will be the member stream next week, Daniel. Yeah, sure will be. That will be a separate uh, giveaway, that will. That will be the usual voucher. Is there a deluxe version of this bedside table thingy? A deluxe version? You can really have it, I suppose, more drawers. So, uh, I suppose you could have a deluxe version, a secret compartment as well. Yeah, see ya. Um, Laser Jet, thanks for coming to Mets here tomorrow. Then connect, there we go. Sometimes I can be hard to get it out. Wait, ready? There we go. There you go. Easy to get that time. Boom, let's quickly push it a little bit. Let's push that one a tad. We plan to get farms in 22 because your streams, it looks nice. It's a nice chilled out game for we crypto. Yeah, nice uh, nice and chilled out. Let's uh, get that. We've got three more to go, so that'll fill up the trailer nicely. And then I'll probably do a contract. We've got 170k, so we can't really be spending on anything. Oh, the chickens, actually. I don't really know how to do the chickens. What do you recommend I do with them? Because at the moment, they're just sat there on health 100%, food 8,510 litres. Okay, they're actually pretty good at the moment. But what, what can I do with them? Where are the eggs? Can we sell the eggs? Oh, they're the eggs. Oh, okay. Well. Why is... Is, is more supposed to be spawning on there? Hmm. Why else can we got eggs, though? Cheers, Pete. Hello, King Carrot. How are you? It. What's Glenn put? Cheers, right, mate. And the rest. There we go. Let's uh, back that on. Yeah, if you ping me, right, I'll add you to the members only section, which is much more relaxed than the general at times. The general can get out of hand. Um, quite easily. So yeah, uh, do ping me and I'll add you as a member, well, as soon as you ping me, pretty much. So yeah, if you ping me on there. Whoa, not like that, Pete. Wow. Uh, wow. Uh, no, what am I supposed to do with them? Not naughty things. Um, sell the eggs? What else can I do? Is that it? Just, just eggs? Do I have to clean them out? Or? Yeah, good to see King Carrot. How you doing, King Carrot? Good evening. Work power hard. He, he's working hard. He's doing his contracts. Shall I probably join him with doing contracts soon enough? I'm doing some harvesting. Oh, harvesting. Lovely. Cool. Yeah, what's everyone up to this evening? Uh, maybe you're just chilling out. Maybe you're playing farm sim. What's everyone playing? What's everyone doing? on this uh, Saturday night. I'll see, uh, pizza fairly easy then. 
low maintenance from Laramita on Mossert, nice there you've got a fairly long journey ahead of you that bit's annoying me there, hold on a sec everyone this bit right there there's no grass on it uh, plants there we go have some of that Yeah, that's better. Right, let's uh, get that on. Now, bees worth it as well. So we could get a beehive. Right, there's that. Let's push that in a little. How do I ping uh, in Discord? Um, press the app button. Yeah, the app button at key, uh, and then just put. Uh, British Ace in it will come up like a list. Right, let's pop this. Uh, let's pop this over here. It does, Amanda. Yeah. In real life, cleaning up chickens, it's uh, they are low maintenance. Uh, yeah, it's uh, quite a messy job. I've done it quite a few times. As we did used to. As we did used to have chickens, now we've got ducks. And uh, trust me, ducks, cleaning them out is bad. It is very smelly. So yeah. Uh, anyway, let's uh, get that on. Yeah, that's all good, 40 Crypto. Thanks for all coming in, mate. Not your thing. Make honey, make money. I'm guessing you just pop it down, that's it. Not much else to it. No, just do general, right? Yeah, just do general. In fact, is your name Lucky Boy? Someone called Lucky Boy joined. Uh, I can quickly add you. Yeah, there's a few people. There's Pomsky and Lucky Boy. Um. Yeah, which which one, mate? Right round we go. Cool. Yeah, we'll get this back to the shop. Um, then I'll go back to the farm. Just make sure everything's tidy. Always got to have a tidy farm. It can't be tracks is wrong way around things in the wrong place everything's got to be tidy lucky boy okay let me quickly sounds good Pete um, lucky boy let's have a look let me quickly add your role uh, there we go uh, you should now have access to the members only hangout and put a vote in for what game you want to see tomorrow you have to scroll up a little bit um, yeah, that is one of the perks of being a members. You get to vote for what we play. Uh, the most recent one was uh, Northern Trans Pen Arms yesterday. And there's one for tomorrow as well. You made a chicken comb out of bed table thingies. Lovely. You got a bed tie, a bed table thingy power? Everyone's getting one. <laughs> <laughs> I still don't know what it is exactly. <laughs> I don't know if other people know exactly what it is. Either everyone just <laughs> loves bedside table thingies. You might have to put a picture of the bedside table thingy in the in the Discord, just so people actually know what it is. Is that an observatory up there? What's that up there? That dome on the hill. Right, 
Right, let's get this sold. No worries, right? There we go. And you usually find me in the members only bit, sort of, you know. You'll find out when I actually get up, as I... I don't really chat in the other rooms on there. Uh, it's just mostly the members bit. As it's never crazy. <laughs> Go on, Pete, you'll love it. How many fields do we have? Uh, four ring to bell. Yeah, four, I think. Oh, no, uh, five. Yeah, 40, 38, 41, 42, and 39. 37 probably will be the next on the hit list. Awesome Permian. But when you've made that, mate, uh, do send it over and I can show it off for you. Get a bit of promotion on it, and I'll if, uh, leave the link in the thing, then I'm sure people would love to download it. Or well, anything like that, scenarios, routes, if I have the available stuff, send send them over. And we can uh, do it on a stream or a video, depending on how long it is. Gives you a bit of promotion for scenario making and all that, so. Right. Here we are. So that is all the setting done. So make sure the farm is tidy and happy. Uh, put down some beehives. Can you keep playing till this until about 1am? 1am, blimey. Uh, probably until 11, Pete. Got a bit of telly Hopefully to catch up, this, uh, catch up on. Hopefully I'll make this contract by then. Yeah, that's all good. Doesn't matter if we go over. No, well, I'm gonna park the car over it. No, uh, yeah, go on them. Use this as the car park. Well, I am as a heady as you know. Hmm. Tempted to make a bit of greenery here. Maybe just space for the car. Um, as we got another parking bay over here, which is big enough. And uh, no, I'll keep it for now. We do, Pete, yes. Uh, well, iPlayer, uh, specifically, so that's more internet. But yeah, TV signal's new to Sussex. Are you still going up at 2 pm? Yeah. Well, about half one. But yeah, greenhouse is going alright. There's a door open. Right. Oh, shall I close that? Very picky about these things, you know. If it has to be right, but are they straight? They are. Mm, mm, that'll be alright. Yeah, that's all good. Uh, not too sure that's doing there. Uh, the tractors are all in the right places. Yeah, let's see about beehives. Let's see, have we got any room over here? Yeah, I could pop them here actually. What are you thinking? Shall we put beehives along this bit here? No, only a couple. Got a bit of greenery here. Uh, perfect sort of amount of space. Yeah, Glenn is, Glenn is right. <laughs> it's <laughs> early, as you know it. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> let's see. Uh, construction. Animals. Arthur, what's another? What is that? Dog house. Oh, yes, for the dog. Um, bees. What one do we want? Uh... Not anything too big. Uh, I think that would be probably too big for that. That's just not too bad being along there. But I mean, that's quite a lot for at the moment. Uh, what about that one? It's alright. You've got like a cat house looking one. He's got a filing cabinet. I mean, I like sort of the classic ones, uh, but then you don't really get a lot 
from them. I think we'll go for... Like I say, you need a pallet location as well. Could that be anywhere, though? Could that be, like, on the other side of the farm, or... So I could pop it there. Sort of in the corner. Uh, let's have one. Let's start off one. Have it... Have it about there. Yeah, what's that thing? Is that, is that good, or... Does that make it a bit clunky, the area? Or have it on this bit here, but then it's sort of... I don't know. Awesome, right? Do you want another suggestion, or... Yeah, okay, well, I suppose we can delete it if need be. Yeah, if we pop it right there. So right on the edge of the yard at the moment. So, is that, is that quick, eh? Pivers. Let's uh, pop that there. There we go. And I'll put the other bit. Hmm. Can we delete this if we pop it down? Or is that not possible? Unless we hide it within the grass. As close as I can. Oh, he, he's gone. Yeah, ah, that looks alright. What does everyone think? Or does that look a bit... Hmm. Pete, what do you think? Reminds me of the song. Should I still stay or should I go? <laughs> Come on, bees, get me. <laughs> or could I move that to somewhere else? Is that, that alright? I mean, it looks alright. To me, that looks alright. Oh, well, we now have bees. Um, right, the farm's all tidy. One's next flight sim, Pilgrim says. How you doing, Pilgrim? Won't be too far. I'd say possibly Tuesday morning. Yeah, possibly Tuesday morning. Uh, yeah, possibly Tuesday morning. I doubt we'll be doing it tomorrow. So, yeah, probably Tuesday morning. Maybe Monday evening. I have to wait and see. It'll be Monday or Tuesday. Right, uh, contract time. Have a look. Let's see what contracts we've got going. Harvesting. Had a lot of, uh, fun with his bees. <laughs> Did yeah. Uh, uh, in his suit. <laughs> yeah. See how when it comes, honey comes out, looks good. Cool. Uh. Hmm. I mean that's very good. Yeah. Let's do that. Let's borrow the items. Uh, yeah, it's only by 1.5. Oh, shall we? Mm. I could use my own equipment quite easily. No, I'll use my own equipment. Let's go and get the class tractor. And the fertilizers along here. Let's get this done. We've got 19 people in. Can we try and get up to 20 likes? Right, what field was it? Uh, field 19. Power's on 45. Oh, that's brilliant, right? It's a brilliant train. Got on here. As we head up to field nineteen. But yeah, thanks all for coming in. Uh, hopefully everyone is all well on this uh, Saturday evening. What have you been up to today, Para? Uh, not much actually. <laughs> Fair enough. Uh, Yeah. 
Fair enough. About uh, exorcism. <laughs> ah. Let me steep up there. Luckily, we've got a slightly more powerful tractor now. It's a bit easier getting up. Field 19 is right at the top. Yeah, looking forward to the new British map coming to think It's Calmston Farm. Uh, not too sure when it's coming out, uh, but when it does come out, we sort of split the streams between this one and that one. And so that's one thing I don't really want to do is move on to the next farm and sort of not finish this one, you know, sort of. Yeah, I don't want to do that. So when Calmston does come out, we're sort of, you know, one stream we'll do this one, next stream we'll do Calmston, yeah, go between the two. Oh, lovely, Pete. <laughs> and maybe when I feel like we're done with this one, we could then try, well, another one. But that would be when we've got, like, you know, everything, which will be a very long time. Alright, let's start fertilising. You're going to buy Cooking Sim for console soon. Fair enough, right? It is a brilliant game. Nice, uh, I mean, you can play Cooking Sim all day. Um, but, you know, it's uh, a nice chilled out game, you know, a couple of hours in the evening or something. Good for that sort of stuff. How's your farm getting on at the moment, Pete? This game seems very therapeutic. Um, well, I suppose fairly. Yeah, fairly. Very chilled out. Sounds good, Pete. Yeah, I'll probably be on for about mm, maybe an hour after after the stream. Um, maybe not an hour. That might be overdoing it a bit. But yeah, for a, a few minutes. Shouldn't run out of fertiliser on this, probably get down to um, what, 20%. See, with this new chat, actually feels like I'm um, you know, sitting in the tractor, sitting back, head against the headrest, going along. It's brilliant. It does, uh, sure does, Glenn. And how are you say? Well, I missed our man, uh, Pete, so. road um not 
little bit more over actually. We're overlapping a bit there. <laughs> there you go, that's alright. So I think realistically you would actually have space between the crops and when you do need to fertilise you don't have to run over all of the crops. I don't think that game, this game simulates that. But yeah, I'm pretty certain in real life you'd have lines between the crops. Tram lines, as I learned from Clarkson's farm. So every, what, two, three rows of sort of planting, you then leave a gap. So then the tractor can then go through and spray without knocking over everything. Which makes sense. On this, I don't think it simulates that. Go on, car. It's always the old one as well it hits us. I'm trying to fertilise it, it just hits me. Unbelievable. There you go, keep it dead on that line there. I think you should either rename the channel The Late Show or The 60 Minutes. Not a bad idea. Narrow tires on your tractor. Well, I suppose that is something you could do on your own field to do rows between uh, props. How you doing, Richard? Are we 5k? Blimey. That's uh, that's pretty good. Yeah, we were one subscriber off when I was recording um, the video just before. So yeah, five k, awesome. Halfway to ten thousand. Yeah, we uh, continue onwards and upwards. Yeah, cheers, uh, everyone. Hey, the mystical code. Uh, yeah, I did find the forklift. Yes, it was hanging out with the chickens. Yeah, awesome stuff. Let me see if it is official. Let's say it might be, you know, be one off still. <laughs> Let's have a look. Yeah, 5,001. Awesome stuff. Onwards to 6,000. And, <laughs> and one, yeah. Cool. Awesome. Well, thanks all for being part of it. Crop rose, yeah. Yeah, thanks all for being part of the uh, channel and uh, keeping it going. It's been a good 15 months. I know the channel does say 2014 when we started, but... Well, in March 2020, I had 100 subs, and that's when I first started properly doing YouTube bits. It was a SnowRunner. Well, no, TSW then SnowRunner stuff. But thanks all for uh, being part of it. You may have been here a week, maybe you've been here... Since March 2020, but thanks all for coming in. <laughs> I thought you did wicker basket uh, making, Pete. Yeah, big thanks everyone. If it was slightly earlier in the day, it probably would have been more sort of like, wow, 5k, and I'd be like, yes, we did it. As it is... Uh, Half ten at night, I'm half asleep, so <laughs> uh, it'll probably kick in tomorrow a little bit. Yeah, awesome. So the next sort of big goal is 10k. I suppose after 1k, that is sort of the next big one. Yeah, awesome. I can't remember when we got for it to 3k. I think we got to 3k when... No, 4k. When the Brighton Mainline come out, I think. So that was. Hmm. Was it 3k then? No, 4k. Yeah, I think we got to 4k when the Brighton Mainline come out. That was October time. So, uh. 
Yeah, that's, uh, that's what's that? Two, three months for another thousand. So yeah, brilliant. And before that, for, when do we get to three thousand? I know we got to two thousand on the road come out, but that was like a, that was like big boost. That was like one of those big games. Um. Yeah, I can't remember. We got to three, oh, three thousand was May time, I think. Um. Yeah, so it's uh, slightly less to. 4,000. On average, how many subs a week? Uh, last stream, maybe 5k. Yeah, you did. Well, hmm, 250 divided by 4. That'll give you the answer, Mr. Quick, okay? Sometimes slightly less, sometimes a lot more. It really depends what is out in that month. But on a month where there's not a lot out, it would say it's about 250. So divide that by 4, and that'll be your answer. So that would be hmm, 55? No, 50 something like it's late. Uh, 55, 250 divided by 4. Um, oh, about 70. No, about 70? No, about 65. Yeah, we'll go for 65. Or 6.25. No, 6.25, wouldn't it be? 6. Point, yeah, 6.25, I think. So that would be 62.5 subs a week. But yeah, it really depends what's coming out. If there's not a lot out, then um, it can be a little less. But say when the Brighton Mainline come out, it was uh, about 500. So, uh, yeah, it really depends what comes out. I mean, this month, well, in December, there wasn't really a lot out. So, 62. That's not bad. Then, what did I say? 6.25, didn't I? Well, that's not too bad. Well, that's that contract finished. Uh, let's see, any other fertilising ones? Uh. Field nine. Field nine. And before anyone says how much do I earn a month on YouTube, uh, you can't actually say that. Yeah, you can't say that. Uh, it's just against the guidelines, or it's just one of those things you, you can't say it. Um. Anyway, except contract. Field nine. <sighs> and the EI Dovto is the current name for Dovto's project. Ah, Pete. <laughs> Right, field, field nine. I wonder what this place is. Quite cool, isn't it? Whoa, oh my, oh, oh. What? That car is, a, that's a lunatic. Oh god, here we go. I mean, that, was, that was the car's fault, really, wasn't it? Everyone's on my side there, right? There we go. <laughs> they just whacked me into a tree. I don't think I've actually been up this way before. I haven't, no. First time coming up this way. You know, let's drive through here. We haven't been through here before. Own 377. That she owns. Uh, a bit ATS, Richard. Go on. Yeah, I haven't been through here before, so. I see if we ever do do forestry, which I suppose isn't the best to do. We'll uh, be cutting down the stuff up here. Little drive through, though. Right, let's uh, head down here. Field 9. Which is, yep, yeah, just along it. So it's almost like two separate valleys then. You sort of get this little valley here. But it's not really, I suppose it's. Hmm, 
not really a valley, but little dips. You get this one, then um, the other one on the other side. I would say sort of my only complaint about the map would be it feels quite open. You know, uh, I mean it's France, uh, so similar sort of, I suppose, landscapes to the UK. So you're probably going to have fairly tight, narrow roads and fields with hedges round. Yeah, similar to that. I haven't been to France, but I'm guessing it would be from what I've seen on the telly and all that. It probably would be fairly similar. But yeah, apart from that, the map is uh, is brilliant. But yeah, that's that's probably my only sort of little thing. It's quite open for a European thing. There's no hedgerows, no tree-lined roads and that sort of stuff. But that's why I'm looking forward to Carmston coming out, the new British map as well. It will be probably very tight to get around and... Yeah. and a bit of fertiliser there. Yeah, a bit right. Now, Pete, going back to saying about the class 377, that would be quite cool. Owning your own sort of coach or you know your own cab car. And how much do trains actually sell for when they are to be scrapped? I suppose it probably still is a fair bit, isn't it? But that would be quite cool though, sort of converting a coach with a 377, you know, into a gaming room. <laughs> actually, no, I would just sort of want to keep it how it is with all the seats, have like a little meet-up area in there. Right. You must get your hat to four hundred lands. <laughs> that means Milton Keynes. Hello Davidoff, I'm all good, how are you? Yeah, I remember going to Milton Keynes, I just remember where the station is, you come out and it's like just very blocky, like you know, the metal shiny buildings and uh, yeah, but it was, yeah, a lot just very blocky and lots of squares and. Is uh, Red Bull uh, racing the one there? Not too sure. Apparently, not sure. Here's Pivers. He's he's returned. You don't know what to do with Carmson as you couldn't find enough work on Chellington with Auction David. I'm sure there'll be stuff to do, Pivers. I mean, it's a farming map. It's not, you know, not like every map's going to be completely different on what's to do. You plant stuff and then harvest it and sell it. As long as I know that, I think I'll be alright. Looked on eBay on Amazon, I confirm no 377 for sale, sadly. Oh. I have one every day when I go to work. Lovely, Glenn. I can't greet cows. Well, cheers, sir, Davidoff. Oh, Red Bull, they're in Milton Keynes. Alright. Wouldn't the main Red Bull be in Germany, though, wouldn't it? Uh, Austria. Oh. Uh, Red Bull is founded in, uh, I believe, Thailand. Alright. And the uh, Dieter Maat machines. What's that? That's where uh, the F1 cars train, and like, Max goes to Milton Keynes. Oh, I thought it was sort of, yeah, I thought it was in Germany or somewhere like that. 
Now uh, almost all the F1 teams are uh, based uh, around uh, Silverstone. Oh, right. Almost all of them. I think Ferrari, of course. Uh, Alfa Tauri are, are also in Italy. And you got... Uh, Alfa Romeo is in Switzerland. All oh, right. Cool. Uh, 377 on eBay, no, no, no. Milton Keynes, yeah. When can we do that heist? Uh, don't know, yeah. uh, Davidoff, mate. Yeah, because Alfa Romeo is still sour. Alright. It's just uh, a sponsor label. Yeah. And Alfa Tower used to be. Minardi. All right. Cool. I should get this contract finished in a second, and I'll head back towards the farm. Yeah, contract on field time finished. Only took what, eighteen percent? Let's get that off. Yeah, I'm not. Finish this one, I'm done. <laughs> yes, it's 6%. Hopefully, it won't be glitched because with the harvest contract, sometimes it does glitch. So, fingers crossed, it won't glitch. <laughs> Luckily, it's not a big, big bump. But yeah, I still need to I think, go back around to August for it to work. Um, but as it's a small one, it might be alright. Just tweaked. Yeah, it's a, it's a good track to this one. I think we will be running class equipment on the farm. Uh, maybe a couple of New Holland bits, but yeah, mostly class will be running. As a harvester, the class harvester is uh, brilliant. And the tractors are good as well. And Klaus, I think, used to be Renault. Uh, Renault. So, I mean, that's French, isn't it? So, sort of alright. Sort of suits the map. Yeah. Ah. No, I think, well, maybe it is now, but I think it was owned by Renault, and I think they are French. Originally, it was yeah, that. Can someone look it up on uh, Wikipedia? Yeah, I think so, yeah. <laughs> In the chat. <jet. laughs> That'd be Just interesting, be sure. right? You would need a lot of land. I think when the British Rum comes out, maybe we'll go for Massey Ferguson or something, but we'll, we can wait and see. Maybe we'll go class again. Massey they right. Is it? I thought Massey Ferguson it sounded British. What is a British oh, company in the game then? <laughs> is there a British tractor Another company? British. Mm. You'd think no. they'd be British. Oh uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. JCB. JCB is British. JCM. They don't really do a lot though. <laughs> Oh, we can get through there. I oh, thought Massey Ferguson was a British company. It's the name Massey Ferguson. Yeah. Well, let's get the tracks clean. American, I'm not 100% sure. Media knows, Let's have a look. Okay, there's a lot on here. Let's just go tractors. Yeah, tractors, uh, medium tractors. Yeah, I always thought they were British ones. I guess that's probably Germany, Fent, uh, Fent Latour, yep. don't know, I'd say they're probably Germany as well. John Deere, that's American, American, yep. Valtra, oh, probably Germany of, as well. Uh, McCormick? Uh, John Deere has bought uh, uh, a German uh, brand, 
so some and a very of the old tractor. Uh, are built in Germany. All right, Valtras, it's got to be Germany. McCormick, uh, that could be British. McCormick. Uh, Valtrak is from Finland. Finland. What about Landini? That sounds Italian. That's quite a cool tractor Landini. though. Landini, yeah, 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 that's Italian. Hello, uh, William, I'm good, how are you? You adopted a shark over Christmas and he's near Portugal. Lovely, right. Uh, class, well, we know that's, I think that's French. Uh, JCB, I guess that is British. There's not a lot they do though. Yep. Just the fast track. Well, that's got to be uh, Deutsch file. That's got to be the German, isn't it? Deutschland. I think it's uh, at least it's German uh, uh, language. <laughs> yeah. So it could be Austria. What about New Holland? American. Uh, American. It used to be uh, Fiat and Ford together. Oh, yeah. And they also have Case. All right. It's almost one company. Uh, what else we got? Okay, there's a yeah, case. There's, there's case on here. I've seen case on yeah, here. Um, yep. uh, case. It's a red uh, tractor. I think that's Swiss Ridgy track. Case. Case is uh, American. Together oh, with yeah. New Holland. Alright. There we go. It's almost the same uh, company. Even the harvest is good so. Hmm. You're all good, Glenn. We won't do that. John, this is all green. Boring. <laughs> Doesn't have a nice slippery. Well, I do like the harvesters of John here. Yeah, alright. I just love the glass tractors with the lime green with the red. Looks really good. And the harvesters are look pretty in it as well. I personally like the Fent uh, tractors. That's all good, uh, William. A little bit expensive, but I like them. Yeah, the Russian dough cow, you or that? What was I gonna do? Oh, greenhouses making noises. Uh, I was gonna go over to power. Let's uh, see how that's getting on. I think you'll be able to get that last bit in the in the tractor. I'm not sure. Have you been taking it to the silo or to the? I would say it's just one. Okay, but yeah. I think they didn't uh, harvest it uh, all the way. Well, if it is a glitched one, I suppose we could try and put this in our silo and just keep it there. If that is. Yeah, sure. Yeah, 81%, percent possibly. Uh, fashion like, yeah, yeah, sure it will. Next on ATS, not too sure, Russian though. Yeah, not too sure. Let's see, what's it? Eighty four percent. Does the selling count as that though? Yeah. Okay. If you see money coming in uh, then you should stop and bring back to your own uh, silo. Yeah.
Right, I'm gonna sell that. That's full. No, it's still a, it's still a bit low. <laughs> oh, you can't sell it yet. You have to bring it to... Uh, the the Harden farm shop, I have. Yeah, I think that's near the top where the question exclamation mark is. Okay. Now you could you could start driving up, yeah, if you start driving up actually. Um yeah, start driving up there after, I guess. Yeah, I can drive it. Yeah. The harvester without the header. Yeah, just the harvester. Escape in the thin air. Yeah, straight up. left it tomorrow's premiere even on the road video or train to mod video as the on the road one somehow is I think 13 gigabytes so I'm gonna have to upload that tonight which will probably take a few hours so yeah whenever that is uh, I suppose yeah probably on the road which I know yeah on the road but I thought we'd Give it a look out again. I think the last one was uh, almost a month back. Just to see if anything has changed, which surprisingly nothing had changed. Well, I'll let someone else pick William for you. If no one picks within a couple of minutes, so I'll, I'll do it. When you did your GCA, what's the question? So, does practicing class harder than the actual exam? Yeah, I'd say so, Russian Dog. I mean, this was 2019, uh, which I probably know a lot's changed. Um, but yeah, I mean, for some of the things, science, science, that was uh, that was one where it was fairly, you know, it was easier than the class uh, questions. But still, prepare by doing harder stuff, and then you'll be all right. I'm going to set it out the farm shop and then we'll see if it does the contract. Hopefully it does. Okay. There you go, right? Are you already there? Yeah, man. It's like field 8. Yep. It's a long. Is that going to go up? It is. 90. Oh, it's looking good. It's looking good, looking very good. Yes, there we go, it worked. That's that, contract finished. Oh, there was still some left in the... Oh, was there? Harvester. Ah. Yeah, it's ah. gone. How much? Oh, well. <laughs> How much was there? Uh, 26% off the tank. Mm, okay, I won't be too. Lot. Yeah. Well, if you oh, spawn into a, at the farm, <laughs> at the forklift, then we'll end up. Tomorrow is Trinks and World cooking sim and maybe flight sim, but we'll wait and see. Home door close. Yeah. <laughs> there he is. Right. Let's let's see the bees. Let's see the bees. That's how they're getting on. They're still buzzing away. There we go. If 
think it's a good spot for the base. It's a good sound effect. Yeah, let's go in it and see the little bees going out. Well, yeah, that is going to be it. Uh, yeah, that is going to be it from me and uh, Power on the Farm. Hopefully everyone has enjoyed that. Obviously, big thanks to Power for joining the game. Two times today. And, uh, Thank you for uh, being here. Yeah, and thanks to everyone for coming in the chat. We've still got 18 people in, so thanks all for coming in. I know it's late, so that's alright. Uh, but yeah, what links can be found in the description to the Discord server, to the PayPal, and to the merch store if you do want to help support the channel. Apart from that, say bye, Para. Bye bye. See you all, and take care. Bye, guys.